Alright, so we're going to be doing the double resistance. A couple of different things we're going to talk about that are very important in the connection in this dance. So, when, our, when we take our centers into each other, we take our, when if I take my center in, we're imagining there's a wall between us. So we're both going to the wall with our centers. The walls between us, we move our centers away. Once we move our centers away, we hook. That hooks us. So if I keep my, my feet in the same place, the hands are in the middle, always. Watch what happens when I move my center in. She needs to respond immediately. Once my center goes in, she has to go in. Once my center goes out, she goes out. So it's equal resistance both ways. Okay, now when we do the double resistance step, what happens is we are doing the normal basic. One, two, three, ah, uh, four. This is normal. Now these hands are in the middle. From the middle, we go into the back action. A five. See, so I'm just moving my center back on a five. I come forward. A six. I go back again. One. And I, I give her a little indication that I'm, I'm holding her for a second because I'm going to leave the syncopated rock with the travel. So we go a two. Now the A2 is the first two steps of a normal underarm pass. Now watch what happens, I just continue. Three, uh, four, anchor, five, uh, six. So if we're doing our steps by ourselves, it looks like this. We are going one, two, three, uh, four. Leaders are moving their centers forward. Now from here, instead of anchoring, they're going to move their center back. A five, a six, a one, a uh, two, three, a uh, four, five, a uh, six. And it opens up so many different possibilities when you get this in and out feeling going. So it goes one, two, three, a uh, four, a uh, five, a uh, six, a uh, one, a uh, two, three, a uh, four, five again. One, two, three, a uh, four, a uh, five, a uh, six, a uh, one, a uh, two, three, a uh, four, five, a uh, six. So then, uh,